After the initial blast site is secured and the wounded evacuated, the EOD team moves forward to collect evidence. The operators who were initially providing ISR cover now utilize another tool, Skydio 3D Scan. Skydio 3D Scan allows anyone to capture high resolution photographs and create highly accurate 3D reconstructions of buildings, objects, or even maps of entire areas with a simple user interface that can be learned in minutes. Doc, performing SV now, deploying 3D scan. From this scan, the operator simply draws a shape around the area she wants to scan. Skydio X2D then autonomously decides where to position itself for each photo. ensuring complete and highly detailed record of the scene. It even moves in and around remaining obstacles, so no angle is left uncovered. Utilizing its powerful NVIDIA Tegra GPU, the X2 simultaneously begins to generate a 3D reconstruction in real time. Meanwhile, high overhead, the second operator monitors the area. Using the Orbit POI skill, she simply taps the location in view she would like the drone to circle, and X2D begins orbiting with full obstacle avoidance enabled. She can now focus her attention on the color and thermal imagers, instead of flying the vehicle. X2D can also assist the operator in identifying both people and vehicles in the scene. After some discussion, two local role players approach the security detail. Through a translator, they say they may know the location of a local man who was unhappy with a market owner and was a former combatant in a militia group. The OIC is called over and relays the information over the radio. Jock, Jock, this is Saber, over. Meanwhile, the X2D has completed its flight pattern for 3D scan and a complete 3D reconstruction and hundreds of photographs are available for further inspection and evidence. The reconstruction logically organizes all the photos so that the evidence teams can capture the entire scene without worrying about losing data. 3D models can also generate measurements for greater understanding of the scene in after-action reports, 